Welcome back everyone to Let's Play Shadow Empire, episode number 41. Uh, man, this has been like a week since I played this game last. And Anyway, we're into the next turn, let's see what happened. Uh, let's try to make this one go a little bit quicker, since, yeah, they bombarded me and then they attacked me. But they actually killed one of my uh, APCs with the bombardment. They killed one of my RPGs, but they took a ton of losses in their attack. Now that's not because of the militia, which you saw dying, but that is also occupied by some laser machine gun um, Galactic Republic troops, if I'm not mistaken. Let's look at the vidcom. This is as much of a refresher for me as it is to show you. Okay, we finished nuclear plant. That's right, we have economic council stuff to do. Cobra's been finished. I haven't even looked at that. Laser rifles is done. Tactical nuke is one of the options now. Plasma in engine is now finished, so we can do VTOL turbojet engines if we want. And I think that that's what we need for... Do we need that to get the, the thopters? Maybe. Okay, and more cards, which, you know, just overwhelming this at this point the number of cards we have and what we're supposed to do with those. Alright, so yeah, we have a new Secret Service Council person we need to elect. Let's go ahead and grab... I did, I, I actually experimented with this, and I think civilian is our best shot, but I was getting a whole bunch of tier ones. Let's see, is that gonna happen again? Okay, cap two. Oh, wait. This person has actually pretty high charisma. So not not like ecstatic, mind and democracy. Well, this, honestly, I think this works. Low authority, eh, pretty high ambition, heroic, emotional. You know what? They're they're hired. They're good enough. Yeah. And it saves me from having to dismiss someone later. And you know they're really gonna like me. I don't think that their relationship could go down too much. Okay, John. Yeah, they are a hundred. But I mean, because of mind and democracy, those are two things that we have in common. So hopefully it doesn't. That the resting point is hopefully pretty high. Active field operations. I think that that's important. And I think spying operations are also really important. In fact, I don't even think internal security is that important, so we'll drop that down to 25. Maybe spying operations should go to 40, and active field operations 35. Yeah, that, that seems fine to me. Um, new economic stuff that we can do. Well, honestly, we're getting down to the very last things we can do at all. Before we can do fusion plant, we need... Uh, Nu wait, nuclear plant. Wait, we have nuclear plant. It's currently impossible. Oh, right, we just need a third tech here, so the military ones have to come into play. And we can't do those two, so we have uh, we have points done in every economic one, except for atmospheric membranes, which is why you can't see them, but physical... Oh, well, you can. You can see physical storage. Physical storage is an option. One of these... Uh, where, where is it? Mining... No... Is it mining techniques? It might be mining techniques is one of our options. I don't remember what the other ones are. They're here somewhere if I was to look long enough. But that, let's not waste the time. Let's just go over here. Yeah, so volcanic energy tapping, water soil recomposition, mining techniques, which we did see. Yes, Gonna do physical storage. Don't really have a... Not, not really good option there. Go back to that again. Let's check out what do we want to do for the military stuff. Well, we could do... Tactical nukes or atomic missiles. I think tactical nukes would be interesting because that should allow us to be, yeah, it says can be fired by a modified howitzer. That's insane. <laughs> so we can do shells for um, radioactives, which should be like, well, very, um, hopefully they're very powerful because I imagine leaving radiation on the ground is not a great thing. So what if we do tactical nukes? Is there anything else that we'd want? I mean, the robotic soldiers, heavy battle dress, these are really good things. However, if we want to continue to move forward with the economic stuff and get fusion plant, which I think we do, then we're going to have to pick something like tactical nuke. So we will. And I think we're, we're doing fine. I mean, the combat dress that we have, I mean, the battle dress that we have right now is, is pretty good. So we need thopter wings, and we probably also need the VTOL turbojet engines to get thopters, but since we're probably going to need the thopter wings, no matter what, and maybe there's an option to do rotor blades or something instead of thopter I mean uh, VTOL turbojets let's just do thopter wings first 
Uh, model council design. I have no idea what we want to do here. I guess we can get a new model of a mobile shield. I, I, would, I think I looked at designs for this. It should only take a turn for us to get it anyway, so let's just do it. I think I want to go with large shield generator. The way I view this is in the situations where we decide we're going to want a, um, a shield generator, the 10 high-tech parts for 18,000 makes more sense than 8 high-tech parts for 12,000. So, large. And then the weight here is 1,010, which means we should probably go with the triple diesel, which will give us pretty good mobility. Unfortunately, it'll take a little bit extra. Do we want that? I think we do. Yes, sir. Okay, that's done. Trade. Let's go quickly. Do we want to sell anything? Probably not. We don't need the money. Do we want to buy anything? It's probably the better question to ask before we need to sell anything. Only if we only if we want to buy something. Food is dropping, so because food is still cheap, we'll get like two thousand credits worth of this. Or maybe we should just get like two thousand food worth. Let's get three thousand food. Why not? I mean, it'd be very easy for us to um, increase our food output, but it's also pretty easy just to buy it. So everything else is positive, so I don't think we need anything else. Fuel's only barely positive, but it also would be another thing pretty easy to increase. So we'll leave it as is. That's trade done. I don't even have my window open at this point, but next is assets. You know what? Forget it. Let's just go right to the battle stuff. Let's just have some fun. So I do have my aircraft here, which can do some attacks. A lot of infantry here, so it'll benefit. Um, we will benefit from a, a heart attack there. By the way, we should, if we look at the battle again, we know exactly where they did bombardment from because the next hex shows us the next turn. So they did bombardment and they did kill one of my troop carriers. And that was in this hex. So I think what we want to do is bombard that with my aircraft. Because if I don't, if I use my artillery, I believe that we could suffer from counter barrage. So let's move here. And we can see that the odds are you know, not necessarily in our favor, even if we're doing artillery. So instead, we will grab you, hit X, I think it's X, air attack, good. And air recon, air attack, yeah. So 99 to one is our odds, which means I guess there's some small amount of attack ability that these uh, ground troops have. So let's do this. I'm okay. Oh my god, this that was a very, very, very unexpected result. But it happened, so there it is. That was very unexpected. I think we got might have even gotten unlucky there. So 214 hit points. And what is theirs? Just the soft attack? Maybe it wasn't so unlucky. Maybe, I don't know. I'm not sure the exact. So these guys don't have any air ability. I would, I would hope <laughs> that you can't shoot artillery up at airplanes. But maybe the machine guns do? Well, they shot it down. Doesn't, I mean, doesn't matter if <laughs> the Proof is in the pudding. It speaks already. They must have had some ability to shoot me down. But um, even then, we have pretty good combat odds to attack. I might even want to shift somebody. Like, you could move in. How do I want to deal with this? So here's the machine guns that held off. We could do bombardment here against these troops and then attack. I wonder if I can take Salzburg this turn. Let's do this bombardment just with you. Roger that. Not bad. I wonder if our odds of capturing the city are better or worse if we push all these troops into Salzburg. Well, let's do the attack with everyone up here and that one, and hopefully they go down here. Oh, but if we're doing the attacks with these troops, then... Yes, they will move south, but then we won't have any movement points left with which to attack the city itself. So it'll kind of be a lost cause at that point. We might as well just attack with everyone, hoping 
hopefully we can just get massive kills. So let's do this hack on all three sides. Technically, they should still retreat here, but I'm pretty sure they'll just retreat there. Oh god, man. These are going worse than expected. Oh, that was rifle militia. We don't care. Kill them. Yeah, didn't kill any of them. Okay, well, they have a lot of people who are retreating back. We move in, and nobody is eligible for the attack. Oh. But they did move down here. Okay. I might want to... So if we do the attack from here and here, they're probably going to move back into the city. I might do it anyway, though, because they will be weak. And then they're going to have a huge penalty. Yeah, I think we're just going to suffer some losses here. And not right now, but I mean, just... Okay, wait. I can actually... I think I'm going to do this attack first. It's already 58 to 1. Holy cow. Okay, let's just do it there. <laughs> Well, that was... Yeah, there they actually held. 58 to 1 and they held? Wait, what am I smoking? That can't be right. But it... I mean... It, but it is. It, it can't be wrong. They're worse than the... So now I need to figure out what to do, right? 73, 73. We will not be favored in an attack against these guys. There's only two of them, and there's a lot more of me. So I don't, I don't know what I'm supposed to do. I, 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 my whole plan, I had a plan in my head, and nothing has gone according to plan so far. Okay, well, let's just do the attack with these two guys. 22 to 1, I mean, after losing 59 to 1, I'm not even sure what to do anymore. We are taking some losses, but it looks like we're going to win this one. I really wanted to kill more of their artillery. Just didn't get a lot of it down. Two dead. And none of the tier 2 ones. Wait, did they hold? Oh my god, they held. This is like becoming just... A just a nightmare. Okay, what's what's your deal? 90, 181, that's pretty good. Unfortunately, I have to say, that's that's actually quite good. How much of it? Three, two? But they also have some ground troops there. Yeah, we can't fight that. What if I do this? Oh, we have another one? Oh my gosh. Well, now I'm thinking we can do the attack. Just to try to get them, because they are better on the... Oh, God. They are better on the defense. There it is. Finally. So we did take a few losses there, unfortunately. Five of our troopers dead. But we killed three of their... Of their tanks. Three of the tank-ish people. <laughs> I think we'll hold the line here. I mean, it's actually not that promising. Move up, but then... Eh, it doesn't matter. Okay, that's... I mean, that's all been very exciting. We will move up our reinforcements as well. So these guys move to the south. So it's kind of nice that one moved north. Just coincidence, really. Um, we have quite a lot of metal produced. I mean, industrial points produced. Metal's... Still fine. So let's go ahead and get some replacements going. We are certainly in need of them. Yeah, one troop carrier already ready. We're gonna need more. Let's just get some more. It's not that bad, man. It's really not that bad. Let's get 10. Okay, because all of our fighting here is done. So, I don't need to replace them directly. They will just get pulled up to the front, but I'm looking for non-troop carriers. Are they all set? Is everyone here set? Troop carrier. 
Troop carrier. Did I already finish it? It's been a while. Troop carrier. Yeah, maybe. Ah, here we go. So let's go to the headquarters here and just replace all of them in the group. So you are the fifth. Which one are you part of? The fifth. Okay. So let's take the fifth. I plead the fifth. Ah, no, I, I guess I have to grab this one. I don't know how else to do it. So master place. All of them in this. Yeah, we need ten. So well, that was a good guess. I can't do it. Is there no logistics? Ah, there's only 67. But, wait. Ah, perfect. Now we should be able to do it, right? Sorry, I'm missing something. Place how many? We want to replace... There's 13 in this group. Okay, what if I just do this particular unit? Roger that. Huh. Well, I, I don't know how to make sense out of that. Let's not dwell on it. We want to try to push. Move quickly. All right, well, let's just see what happens if we just attack with everyone. We either win or we lose. <laughs> so we'll find out which one happens. Maybe it's a win. It is. All right. Fantastic. You can move north to so just pull you back, essentially. You can stay there. Everyone else can stay there. Okay, fan. Fantastic. We made some progress. We did something right. Well, there's the radioactive. It's not the best place for it. And you guys are still shifting all the way around. So you can probably divert more logistics to the north, but I'm actually not sure what we should be doing with these guys. Let's just continue to move them. Yes, yeah, so you don't go out this way, but you're allowed to come in. Yeah, that, that seems all fine to me. Okay, have you move here. Uh, looks like what we're going to want to do is cut them off and then attack them. Could actually cut them off with the artillery, but... Hmm. Do we care about recycling three? Huh. Maybe, actually. That, that could be interesting. We've taken it and we can still move back, but I think what I'd rather do is move the tank in? Now what if we attack with these units? 16 to 1. Let's try it. Man, these guys are so good. Everyone's killing my units. They hell Oh my god. I don't know if something's going wrong with my calculator maybe there's been a patch in shadow empire that over 10 to 1 no longer means you're gonna win something's wacky i was hoping to use the artillery against these forward units boy okay well there's another thing i could do it's not really what i want to do but i guess we can bombard the unit it's going to just wreck them. Roger that. And then, yeah, I can do the attack with that guy. Can you do another ranged attack? No. And then, 8 to 1. Go for it. Move it now. There it is. I don't know. I am. Uh, I don't understand that at all. <laughs> don't ask me. I, I don't know. Alright, well, let's get... You here, and you here, so that each person has some other defense. 
and you're there, and you can move there. With you, oh, good. So we have somebody else who can move forward. 15, you haven't lost anybody yet, so we'll move you up here. So just so you're ready to do something better next turn. I bombard that. Wow, we, I mean, we crushed them, but nobody is available to attack unless... No, 1.3. Okay, we're done. We're done with the attacks. We're done with everything. I think essentially at this point, assets are just going to be used. Um, not supposed to be doing anything with assets, but <laughs> we do need ammunition, though. So let's get maybe 5,000 ammunition. Yeah, can we... Re I don't understand why we can't replace these guys. Oh, we can. No, we can't. That is... That's, huh. That doesn't matter. Don't fixate. Okay, 22 minutes. This is actually good. We got one turn done in 22 minutes. I don't even know if I need to show you the assets. I mean, what what is even going on with these? Okay, we're building demineralization, solar plants, heavy industries being built, which is good. We need that. What? What? Oh, heavy industry. Well, that's also good, but industry is actually more important right now for the IP, which is the main, main uh, bottleneck. It's always something, right? But not too bad as far as a bottleneck. As far as bottlenecks go. Surprising to me, we are not upgrading. We're not even building over here a industry 2. It takes 125 metal by... I mean, this by itself, it takes four turns... And 200, so it does take a while to get this back. I don't know, maybe it is better. Are we building the industry over here? I thought we were doing this somewhere. No, we're not. Okay, well, we're gonna continue to get more industrial points when the uh, industry here finishes. Maybe that's what I'm relying on. Four turns, gonna take four turns. All right, let's just, I mean, as these buildings finish, as we're not building more buildings, that'll also give us more industrial points. So let's leave it as is. Uh, I think I'm gonna go back and replenish, make sure the replenishment pool is satisfied. We want trooper four. That's right, these guys take the good stuff. We need some of these. We need to be building actually a lot of these hauler for twos because the entire Area is obsolete, but that's fine. Our transports, we're done with that. And we actually are missing some machine guns. Let's produce seven of them. And I know what we're missing, a <laughs> tactical bomber. Uh, which one are these? The tricksters, right? Yeah. No scroll window. Okay, 193. Yeah, we can. It's the last thing we're gonna do. All right, so I'm not gonna worry about assets. We're just gonna end the turn. I'll look up around off camera, but probably nothing. Okay, the only other thing I didn't do is move these guys. So let's just move these guys. Okay, everything's done. Just need to get them into supply. Okay. So I didn't I didn't think about this. I mean it's gonna take up Crack Glacier doesn't have a whole lot of population to deal with right now. So it's gonna kind of suck the truck station personnel out. But I'm gonna go with this anyways. I don't know if this is a good idea or a bad idea, and I think that I should just think about it a little bit more and I'd realize one of those is the right answer. Okay, so let's do private industry target our new zone, Crag Glacier. Yes, sir. Okay, some private credits moving in. And then we're going to start giving, um, giving them all these things. Roger that. Roger that. So this will make them happy, but it's going to require population to work. 
Maybe that's not a good idea. I don't know. Roger that. Um. Commercial project. Roger that. Roger that. So it should help the happiness, even if people aren't Roger working. That. 1600 credits. Okay, so that's fine. We don't need to put a ton of investor backing in there. I feel like that is already enough. We just hope that that's enough to draw more population in because population is an issue. Call this guy. Actually, make sure the zone orders are that nobody. Yeah, don't get anybody. That's right. Unincorporated, that's good. Public budget of two. I think that's going to be Roger good that. enough to confirm. All right, let's end the turn. Okay, well, let's take a look at the turn. Um, play. We were bombarded. No deaths this time, which is good. Maybe it's because of the attack we did. Maybe not. Not a whole lot, by the way. That's it. Nothing more to look for. Vidcom. Mining metal facility. 7310 was removed because the resources are gone. Metal mining facility. That's a bummer. 7310. I'll have to take a look at where that was. We failed our democracy. Crap. Stupid. Uh, physical storage is done. That was quick. Shielder's done. And we have laser guns. Which is... This is a discovery, not that we've researched it, but it's interesting. Complete adopter wings. We have lightweight alloys, which is interesting. Can make all of our aircraft a little bit better if we want to do that. But I don't... I don't know how much we're going to put into aircraft. We've already seen the preposterous am ammunition demands. Okay, so applied science can just stay where it is. I don't think that there's any reason to discover anything. We just want to just keep plugging. Economic Council, we'll just keep going down the list here. We'll take 83 as the next one, which will surely finish within a turn. Yes, sir. And then we'll dump all those points onto the... <laughs> the the linear tech when we're done. Um, I'm gonna, so is this a lightweight alloys? I just wanna check, is this a, yeah, it is a gradual tech. So we, let's do Vidal first. Order acknowledged. I mean, it doesn't really matter, right? We're, we're not gonna be doing aircraft anyway. Yeah, we do have a model to build, but I don't know which one to build for this. I was looking at it. Okay, yeah, I do. I do. Um, so I was looking at all the different models that we have. That's what we were. I was here for. Artillery isn't anything new because we get we got the laser guns, and they're supposed to be a big improvement. Um, based on the techs here, conventional gun was at 77 when we did this. I don't know if I'm reading this correctly, but conventional guns was only at nine when I was when I did the um, both the Zion two and the all rounder. Does that mean that these are much, much, much older? So vehicle armor was at 22. Vehicle armor was at 54. Light armor, vehicle armor. Yeah, so it was at 80. It must be that this is really kind of cutting edge. So I think we're going to hold off doing any of those. I could maybe just upgrade the, the mechanized artillery. Oh, I did go... Um, I did go to the quality. I went through at least some, some of these. Like, uh, hauler 2 was none, and this was on regular, hauler 0 or 1. So I made that low, did this, and did that for several of them. Just essentially updated what should already have been done. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I don't know where the next one should be researched. Let me just figure it out off camera. I'll come back in when I only have a, a decision ready to go. Free trade. I, th I don't think this is a good idea if we're going to play a long, long-term game, because ultimately Perfect Resto will be an enemy. But for now, I don't, I don't care. Just make people happy. Speed things along. Trade is interesting. I think that it, well, not really, it's not critical in any sense, but I think we will do um, buying of some more food because nobody seems to care. Just a thousand. And the main reason for this is I just, okay, I'll, I'll take any, oh. Yeah, just buy a thousand. Why did I do it that way? I did it the wrong way, but it doesn't matter. And we're going to sell... Um, we could sell some metal. Of all things. Actually, I'm not going to do this because... I was going to do this 
with the metal mine right now? 77 whatever? Is that this one? Ten. Seventy-three ten. Yeah, it was this metal mine. Can't believe it's already it's already gone. Now there is um we could put a recycling center there, but for now we're not gonna do anything like that. We're gonna save all of our industrial points. Got two thousand of them. That's good. Anyways, I just we're beating around the bush. We want to get to the main thing, which is the action. So let's just do it. Let's go ahead and attack again with our aircraft. I know it didn't go particularly well last time, but well, if at first you do not succeed, try, try, try again. Oops. Got the wrong one. All right, let's do it. Did get hit again. Aha. These are going better. Got hit three times. Um, but this is much better. We killed rifle militia, not a big deal. Two of these no, this is retreat. We killed two of the artillery, which is fantastic. Caused one of them one of the other ones to retreat as well. Didn't do too much other than that, but that's probably the most significant thing they could have done. Now, although I did that. My goal in this turn is to capture Salzburg, which that's all the marbles, right? Once Salzburg falls, the rest of this group doesn't disappear because it is a major, but basically the, the fighting the fighting ends. They're going to be out of supply. I mean, it should be just an easy win for us. So I think what I want to do is move here and do bombardment. So apparently one of them has like a militia artillery that they're going to counter fire with. We'll go ahead and take that. They're pretty stuck in. This is not good. Roger that. Yeah, we didn't do very much. That's unfortunate. I am a little bit less confident in our ability to get a victory here. Hmm. What else could we do? These guys do have two. I think it might be worth it for us to actually do the bombardment here. Oh man. Yeah, I probably should have just used them in the in the first action. Is it possible for us to shift? I don't think so. So I think we just want to go for it. Nine to one odds. Hey, that's better than whatever it was before. But if we do this, this is 22. I think we still want to increase the number. By the way, what kind of... Let's just look at the difference. Let's move you. So three is in there. Let's move with without three. With three. Yeah, okay, let's do it. Definitely taking some hits. I don't think we're gonna get it. No! Okay, well, we did do a lot of damage. We weakened them, but it wasn't enough. We're definitely gonna follow up and attack. <laughs> definitely. Not with a heavy wheeler, though. We'll, we'll keep that one there. Not with you. Ah, you have three heavy wheelers too. Damn it. Okay, here's number nine who can move up. Two. Yeah, damn. Damn, damn, damn. Okay, I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna see what happens. Hopefully we don't push them back into the city. But even if we do, it's probably okay, because we should be just doing a whole lot of damage now. So they actually held. This is perhaps the best scenario for me, that we did a ton of damage. 
but we help, but they help so they don't retreat back into the city. I'm happy with that. I'm very happy. Oh, we don't have anybody else in here. Which let's move this unit here. I think. Wait, five is actually down here, and four needs to go up here. Small mistake. Could have done the attack here, but we don't actually want to push him out. I could keep pushing on this unit. Try to cause more damage. Honestly, I think I think it's the right move. Just kill him. Don't let him recover. We'll leave that one there. Fair enough. Okay, now once you guys get your replacement troops, which you should be able to do, I think, immediately? Are you gonna have a problem this time? Like, let's just do the entire... Okay, let's just do it in this unit. Roger that. What the hell is going on? I don't know. There's something... Somebody in the comment section will let me know. Please. Please figure, figure this out for me. I am, I'm just too... I'm too stupid to figure it out. Feels weird saying that, but I, I, I know that this series is on, like, a timer. I don't know how much longer it's going to be around for. So... My investment is decreasing as well. Get these guys back. Maybe they can help out before the fall happens. Not much longer is left, though. Salzburg is already... I mean, it's nice to have them way out here, actually. Way down here. Draws them out of the city where, you know, I mean, that's the worst part. I don't want them there. We probably need to set up more for the next turn. So we have a lot of people here, which is good. One here, one there, one there. Um, yeah, I, I don't know how to, to manage this situation if they aren't going to upgrade their troops. Kind of funny. Like, there can't be a logistics problem getting them to the same hex. <laughs> I don't, <laughs> they don't have to go anywhere. They just move them. <laughs> oh, but there is obviously bottlenecks, which I haven't really been paying attention to. Yeah, it all happened. It's all happened in here. Kind of surprised that there's a bottleneck here, but eventually, when we have a high-speed rail over in Kagoyas, we won't have this problem. Anyway, just going to call the episode to a close here. I'll figure out what else we need to do, and I'll... Um, and then I'll end the turn before next episode, so we can try to make a little bit better progress. But for now, thanks for watching. Stay safe and take care.